Hey, ha ha, high five. What's going on, YouTube peoples? Hey, hey, high five. Yeah, motherfucker. Have a peppermint. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> I just wanted to say thank you to everyone that's sent responses to a few of the old videos and sent me emails asking me to stick around to YouTube. I've kind of considered it. I'm still kind of set on dropping me off. It's, it's, it's still old. I do enjoy making the videos. It's obvious that you guys appreciate the videos and actually listen to them. So, thank you. This video was pretty much just random shit that I've had going on the last couple of days. And I also wanted to say thank you to everyone that sent comments and responses to me, you know, pretty much ending this YouTube account. Oh my god, I hate when people say this, but I gotta keep it 100, keep it real. If this video sounds kind of choppy right now, I'm trying to peel an orange and trying to, you know, stick to my uh, diet again and uh, cut a little bit of weight. And uh, I'll explain that later. So, you know, if it sounds weird, I apologize. As a matter of fact, my neighbors listen to something downstairs. It's like really loud and religious. So if you hear muffling going on in the background, that's the reason for that. However, I don't know where you guys are right now, but you could like, you know, put your location down in the comment box after listening to this video. But here in Cleveland, the last couple of days, it's been hot as hell. Oh, oh. Ow. Ow. yeah, hot as hell. Not that I'm complaining, because in the winter time here in Cleveland, we get major snow. So thing is, is I'm not complaining that much about the heat. You know, I can bear with it. But the thing that annoys and irritates the hell out of me is that the girl I've been kicking it with for you know for like you know for a little bit of time now constantly bitches and complains. It's already bad enough when it's hot and you're annoyed, but then you also have to listen to. Oh my god, you don't listen, you're annoying me again. You never do anything, we never go anywhere. Oh my god, you never listen to me. You, you listen to me right now. Oh, you're annoying me again. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, see, that's what I'm talking about. And me, I'm thinking, shut up, shut up, shut up. This is why I'm not listening to you. Shut up, shut up. Ooh, hey, look, a bird. Yeah, shut up, shut up, shut up. Okay, is she done? Okay. <laughs> so the other day was July 4th. And, you know, I figured, all right, let's go. Watch the fireworks at the beach. Woo woo. Break it all down. Whatever. Yeah. And by the way, Cleveland does have beaches for people that don't know about Cleveland. Ta da. Yeah. New fact is not all about freaking LeBron. New contract. Woo! Stay here. Fuck you. Go away, LeBron. But anyway. Yeah. So took her to the beach just to shut her up. Guess what? Didn't work. So went to the pool yesterday. For any guy that's ever gone to the pool with your girl, wife, mistress, whatever. Bad idea. Ladies, same thing. Never, ever, 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 ever. Go to the freaking pool or the beach with someone that you love, care about, or, you know, you're just friends with. Bad decision. We get there and I see old people. Young people, fat people, short people, tall people, people in the water, people on the side, uh, people chasing around. Like I saw people with fantastic bodies from the head to freaking toe wearing long ass t-shirts. I saw big people that had no fucking business at all whatsoever wearing shit that they had no business wearing. Oh, and keep in mind, just because I'm making these videos, I am average, average, and be before yesterday, I swear to God, I just thought I was average, and after that, I'm now below average. I'm telling you, look, here's a picture right here. Ting! Fellas, you have to be absolutely super duper secure to go to the motherfucking beach, I'm telling you. Not only to go to the beach, but to you know let things go okay listen there is always one to Bay at the fucking beach this dude i don't know either he eats steroids wheat and protein all day these are the guys that that you knew from years ago as kids they were the ones that had not only the six pack the eight pack abs like strong they do crunches while sitting on the toilet. We were walking down the sidewalk. 
this dude is walking toward us going you know in the opposite direction i see this big muscle bound gorilla i just got out of the joint three days before this walking toward us and i'm thinking to myself girl if you look over at him i swear to god i will snap your fucking neck so the pressure's on for her so she looks over at me with this look like look at that thing so little mother look right there oh my god god damn it. i hope you didn't see me look oh shit oh shit <laughs> i mean i'm guilty too i mean from time to time you know i would catch somebody out the corner of my eye and think to myself look at that look right there with the big ass titties look at the thighs on the oh god damn look at that one over there but most of the time i did the right thing and looked in the opposite direction but thought to myself god damn look at the face hurting on that motherfucker right there two words cook a book cook a book motherfucker cook a book <laughs> put it to you break your back <laughs> so this is the reason why i'm about to eat an orange because the dollar menu at mick freaking donald's has been very good to me i will admit it bravo bravo hurrah hurrah hooray it's just a reminder for me to get back on the grind because i'll be goddamned if i'm going somewhere and 19 year old dante that can barely spell with that dumbass look of yeah and what i work out eight days motherfucking week yeah and your girl like it <laughs> see my skinny jeans and my baby shirt <laughs> that's all the way up to my fucking shoulder <laughs> that's a full shirt <laughs> see it's not about starting an argument with the whole you look at him i know you looked at him you want him you lust you <laughs> i know you want him no it's not that it's just a reminder to keep yourself up not only to keep yourself up stay healthy but most of all it's about staying fit being healthy and staying strong mentally and physically especially if that young bastard happens to look over his shoulder as you walk by and disrespect you and then you have the legal right to kick his monkey motherfucking ass <laughs> Oh, what's the matter, push-up boy? Punch to the face? <laughs> Kick to the stomach? <laughs> you took a picture? <laughs> Can't take it back. Can't take it back. Can't take it back. <laughs> Whooped your ass. <laughs> Look at you on the ground now, bitch. <laughs> Look at it, my girl. Was it really worth it? Was it really worth it? <laughs> Is the ground hot, bastard? <laughs> Baby, go hurry up and start the car. This motherfucker about to get back up. Oh, shit. Go start the car. <laughs> oh, damn, damn, damn. Can't run like a used to. God damn, this McDonald's I'm all heavy and shit. Oh shit. Hurry up. Move, move. Oh shit, he getting back up. God damn. Oh yeah, hey, by the way, if you thought this video was silly as hell, go over to my original page on YouTube. That's double I. That's D-O-U-B-L-A-H-H. -H, and check out my new video for Not Good Enough. It's a funny ass video. Check it out. I'm out. Later.